This one's called a full body flow. So we're gonna do the same again. So we're gonna go for three five minute rounds. Again, if you can't get all five minutes in, just go as long as you can. So you increase that time under tension each time you perform the workout as you get stronger, as your skill increases, as your cardio increases. Again, if you can't do all these exercises, just break it down into one or two movements and then build up as you get better and as you get more skilled and as you get more control of the mace. So you not, might not be able to get all these exercises in to start with, but just build up as you get going. And before you know it, you'll be able to do the whole lot straight off the bat. All right, so we're gonna break it down now, go through the workout. So first off, we're gonna go into Bondi swings and then into uppercut, into overhead press. Okay, so I'll just show you what that looks like. So we're gonna do our single arm 360 swing. So single arm 360 swing. We're gonna catch it behind the body. From there, we're gonna go straight into uppercut. So pivot off that back foot, rotate the hip, bring it back into the starting position, shoulder press, and now we're gonna go over the other shoulder. So we're gonna do a 360 squat, come up with the right hand side now, pivot that back foot, rotate the hip, bring it back into the starting position, and then from there, shoulder press overhead. Again, you can increase that leverage as much as you want. So you do your shoulder press, and then from there, we're gonna bring it into the rack position. We're gonna do a swing squat. So this is an exercise that we teach in the steel club course, but you can also do it with the steel mace as well. So throw, casting that forward, hip hinge, catching it into that front position, bring the mace towards the body, press it out if you can. Okay, and then from there, standing up, we're gonna do our 360 into Rotational uppercut, changing sides, 360, rotational uppercut. So with these rotational uppercuts, just bring that hip around, pivot the foot, bring that top arm back as you punch up with that bottom hand. Okay, so I'll show you again. So Bondi swing, uppercut, shoulder press, other side, Bondi swing, uppercut, Shoulder press, swing squat, press out, stand up, 360 swing, rotational uppercut, 360 swing, rotational uppercut. Okay, we're gonna go continuous now, so Bondi swing, uppercut, shoulder press, Bondi swing, uppercut, Shoulder press, swing squat. 360, rotational uppercut. 360, rotational uppercut. All right, so that's it for this workout. Again, just power through, try and get three five minute rounds and if you can, try and get as many of those flow exercises in as you can, but build up as you go. And don't worry if you can't get it first time, the more you do this, the better you get, the easier it gets and becomes quite natural for you. So I hope you enjoyed this workout and I'll see you in the next one.